let's run a compliance assessment on a GCP project. Within the Cloud Guard portal, go to the Posture Management tab and click on Rule Sets. Let's filter for GCP. These are all of the rule sets that come out of the box within Cloud Guard. Uh, there's both security best practices and compliance frameworks. I'm going to choose CIS Foundations. Here we can see the rules. I'll click Run Assessment and choose the relevant GCP accounts that I want to test. Once the results are ready, I'll click Go to Results. Here we can see at the top some visual breakdowns showing which entities have been tested and the severity level of the alerts. And if I expand on one of these results, you'll get a more detailed description of what this rule is testing for, what are the remediation steps that you can take in order to fix this issue, and a list of the entities that failed this test. Now from within these entities, you can do a few actions, including preview the entity, create an exclusion so that this rule won't be tested on this entity anymore, or configure an automatic remediation so that if this rule is ever failed again, Cloud Guard will go and automatically fix it, as well as alert you. Now let's go in and create a customized rule set with custom rules that are unique to my organization. If I go into the rule sets, I'll click on one and click clone. You need to create a clone of the out of the box rule sets in order to edit and customize them. Now from within this cloned rule set, if I want to create my own custom rules, I'll click on new rule. Click into GSL and this will open up the GSL builder, which is an intuitive tool for building out custom rules without needing to know any scripting knowledge. You click on any of these entities and it'll auto populate the different options for building out the rule in an intuitive way. I want to create a rule that ensures that auto backup is enabled for a Cloud SQL instance. I'll add a title to my custom rule, as well as a description or any automatic remediation that I want to configure. Within the compliance section, I can add specific tags that I want this rule to be associated with. I can also change the severity level. Uh, in this case, I'm going to move it from high to medium severity. Now click Save, and this rule will automatically be added to my customized cloned rule set. If I search for anything in the description of the rule, including the compliance section tags that I added, I can find this rule. With Cloud Guard, you can enable compliance and governance regulations on your GCP projects, as well as security best practices, in just a few clicks.